and I'm the Learning Engagement Officer at the St Barb Museum and Art Gallery. Today's video is talking about the Bronze Age. Now the Neolithic period that came before um, highlights how life changed for people and the, their living situation and how they changed from being foragers to farmers. What followed was the Bronze Age period and that period was named so because people started making tools out of this metal called bronze. Europeans came over and taught Britons the skill of making this metal and it just so happened that the raw materials, tin and copper, could be found in Britain also. But people didn't just suddenly stop using stone and the, the bronze period didn't suddenly stop the Neolithic period. They oh, crossed over um, people were still using stone after people had discovered that um, this bronze material could be made. And bronze was quite hard to make. Bronze tools were hard to make. It took a lot of skill and a lot of effort. So actually it became quite a, a symbol of, of how rich you were. If you could have bronze tools or bronze decoration, then you were quite rich. And that's why stone tools and, and, and things carried on being used um, for a long time after bronze was introduced. I've got quite an interesting object to show you in our collection. It's not real, it's a replica. And the reason we use replicas in museums is so that you get to handle things that otherwise might be too delicate or might be too dangerous. Um, so it's, it's a great way of exploring objects. It's bronze in colour, just like it would have been if it had been made um, back in the Bronze Age. And it's a great example of a Bronze Age axe head. It would have been cast using a mould and liquid bronze would have been poured into the mould and cooled. 